morning guys this is day 13 I'm some way up Forrester Pass GoPro doesn't want to seem to turn on at the minute I'm not stopping here to sort it out I'll sort it out later probably at the top so get back to you in a bit guys there she is there's the path I can make out people up there Ooh. Forest to pass. Let's get hiking. All right, guys, this is the uh, north side of Forrester where we came up. This is the top of the pass. Sign. And the view to the south. Forest of Paths. 1300 feet and a bit. 13 too, I think. Personal best, over 13,000 feet. And ice pass on the GMT. <laughs> So cool, aren't they? Okay. No, they're so not scared of people. Kind of crazy. Just kind of like, eh, just keep eating. <laughs> and then I'll steal all your food if you haven't got it in oh, a bear barrel. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> they can be so sneaky. Don't think you can read the sign, guys, but if you can't, it says, I'm badass. 13,200 feet for us to pass. Last views. Alright guys, so GoPro's up and running again. I uh, think it just must have turned on in the night. Um, generally, you put your electronics and your filter to the bottom of your sleeping bag at night because cold kills batteries and cold kills filters. So um, I must have just knocked it and switched it on and I think the last battery was dead. So fresh battery in and we're all good. Beautiful walk to the forest there. There somewhere right behind me. Uh, just in tree line again now. Down to Tyndall Creek. Heading on to Crabtree Meadow. And, uh, an early night for maybe a night hike up to Whitney for uh, sunrise tomorrow. So I'm looking forward to that and I'll show you what the rest of the day brings. Could be first views of Whitney in the distance. What an epic view. Amazing scenery. On our way to Whitney. Scenery's completely changed. Like being in a desert. So dry.
I might be lying to you, I'm not sure if that is Whitney. I think we have to go on another valley. Look at this plateau. A final sting in the tail before getting to Crabtree Meadow. All the way down there. Go all the way up the other side. Thousand footer. It doesn't even hardly show on the topo maps. Just snuck it in there. That is a happy sight. Because I think that is my climbing done. Until Whitney tomorrow. That would be nice. I don't believe it though, there's always a sting in the tail. Whew. Look at the elevation profile for Dane. He's like, oh, it's okay. Pretty flat. After Forrester. No, there's still some ups and downs. Ooh. Been a good day though. People, this sign makes me very happy. Crabtree Meadow Range Station, one mile. Mount Whitney, 8.3. I wasn't expecting the approach to uh, Crabtree Ranger Station to be so barren and so dry. 0.2 to Crabtree Ranger Station. Once you go past this point, uh, you're doing your business in a bag. Alright guys, <clears throat> no idea what this angle looks like, probably hideous, lying in bed, um, I'm going to get an early <sighs> Alright guys, try that one again, um, lying in bed, um, trying to get an early night's sleep, going to do a night hike up Whitney tomorrow to watch the sunrise. There's a few people that I've met en route today that are doing the same thing. Um, so I'll probably see all them on the top. Or they'll probably all fly by me on the way up. Um, so yeah, tomorrow, day 14, and tomorrow's Whitney. So can't wait for that one. Good night, guys.